Um, I would I would say to everybody out there, if you are struggling spiritually, if you, you know, maybe were once in a place where you and God were tight, and then you kind of fell off a little bit, and you're looking for a way to get back in that tight relationship with God, I would I would highly encourage uh, anybody to go through this academy. It has been life-changing, life-saving. Um, the Holy Spirit leads Kendra in such a way that she just brings it all to us and she lays it all out there and she she don't mince her words. <laughs> she doesn't, you know, <laughs> she's very straightforward person, very blunt person, but she tells it to you in love. And so it, it's really just an eye-opening experience. So I would encourage anybody to be a part of it. Yes, the same here. Um, as a young person, <laughs> as a millennial, Kendra um, is far beyond that knowledge. Um, when I looked at Kendra, I see Kendra as Mary. Because when you think about Mary, when she became pregnant with Jesus, she was a young girl. But she matured to a level that she was able to accept what was handed to her. You're going to give birth. She accepted that as a young girl. She truly embraced the idea that she was going to bring the Savior into the world. And Kendra, and you know, as older people, we look like, dog, would I have been able to do that if the mm -hmm. Holy Spirit told me <laughs> I'm going to be praying? <laughs> if the Holy Spirit tell me at 60, I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> it ain't going down like that. <laughs> but Kendra embraces what God has given to her. And she has no problem sharing and what God has given to her. And the thing about it, when I realized, Kendra, I've always known you to care, but there was one session that we was we was dealing with, and um, I could tell in your voice that you wanted me to take care of me. And that meant a mm -hmm. lot to me. Um, I was like, oh my God. <laughs> I was too. <laughs> that was an intense moment. Yes. <laughs> I remember. And <laughs> it meant a whole lot. So if there's someone out there that you really honestly want to look at you, you honestly want to do the work, then Kendra is the person. Um, the Academy is the place to be. But if you don't want to do the work, don't waste her time. Amen to that. <laughs> right. Amen to that. Right. Because tomorrow is going to be great. <laughs> That's go. right. You have to put in the work. You have right. To exactly exactly well i'm excited for y'all um and for the journey that god has given you and for the revelations that you've uh gotten and you know for trusting me to help you through the process and um so it's 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 always you probably wouldn't believe that it it, it uplifts me as well um because i'm always just like boom 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 you know and you know mm -hmm. Here, boom, boom, boom. But it's also like for me, it's like it's just continue a continuous confirmation of what God needs me to do, um, and that I'm on the right path, and that uh, I'm, I'm listening properly. And you know, the confirmation comes again, and, and then we have another session, and it's like, all right, God, you know, we we, we building this thing. <laughs> uh, so, so thank you for trusting me with the process and allowing me to see your growth and just being vulnerable, you know, even in the the community. Um, so that you can grow and continue to move forward in what God has for you. So I'm excited to see your ministries bloom and grow and, and start and elevate and, and all that good stuff. Um, 